the Trump speech was a perfectly targeted speech for this audience. He was very emollient. Uh, he emphasized that America's open for business, that he's transforming America, that he wants them to come to America to invest. That's the core of what he wanted to say. That he also said that you know, we want free and fair trade. We don't want, we're not protectionists. He didn't indicate that. Uh, he uh, would even, might even join uh, the Trans-Pacific Partnership, he indicated. Well, that was very, uh, very, very emollient. And he also emphasized that it's America first, because every leader, as he said, very specifically, has to look after their own country first. But that's not against the interests of the rest of the world. If America is successful, all the world is successful with the world's biggest economy, and that's very important. So for this audience uh, of international business people, this was a very well-designed uh, and well-targeted speech. Would it have changed their views on him? No, there are lots of things the international business people here disagree with him on very strongly, but I think it's the best speech they could have hoped to hear from him. Well, actually, um, I was not that much surprised. He was like a, he was selling his country. He's a businessman, and he was uh, like doing uh, advertising for his country. He says, "Let's do business in the United States. Come to me. Come to us." And that's what you can expect uh, from a businessman. Well, actually, all the other uh, um, topics like uh, climate change, like uh, like digitalization, all the problems with jobs and society, all that was missing, and all the like the geopolitical risk. There was nothing happening, so uh, or nothing to hear. That's what I missed.